Hi, welcome back to Superior Self with KJ Landis. Today, I'd like to talk about your big why. Why is now the time to make a shift in your life that will enable you to become your superior self. I need you to write it down. No change ever happens without somebody feeling extremely desperate or extremely scared. So there must be some impetus of change that is inspiring you, motivating you, or pushing you. You need to know why. You need to see it, you need to feel it, and you need to write it down every single day. I'm only motivated to do something when I'm pushed to do it in a deep way. I write three things down every day after having my big why down in front of me. I write three positive affirmations down that I live as if they're happening now. I say those three positive affirmations and I live them as if they're happening now, even though they're my desired goals in the future. I call it the future present. Write down your big why and then write down your goals. I think three goals are enough. You can actualize them. It starts in the head, it passes through the heart, and physically writing them down on paper in a little notebook on a post-it notepad, keep them everywhere. Repeat them out loud multiple times in the day. It may sound crazy, but I repeat it in the car, in the mirror when I'm driving. I repeat it when I'm on the toilet. I repeat it when I'm brushing my teeth. I say it in my head. Everywhere I go, I'm repeating those three things that I know are going to happen in my future if I just create new neural pathways in the brain because I am creating those new things to occur in my life as if they're happening right now. But I have to know why I'm doing them. Why am I creating the goals? Once I actualize one goal, one creative thought that is becoming my future present, I drop it. Once I've actualized it, I drop it and I add a new sentence. So that cycle continues of three positive affirmations every day in my life. I got lots of notebooks and lots of little pieces of paper. You forgot your notebook? It's okay. Put it on the back of an envelope, the back of a receipt, the back of a napkin. Even if you're at the gas station or a 7-Eleven, grab an extra napkin and you write it down. The physical act of having it go through the heart and onto something physical means the world to your brain. It's science, people. Thoughts are powerful. Thoughts create your reality and your future with your heart and your physicality and your creative mindset. Here we go. What is your big why? Then your positive affirmations. I'm here to support you. If you love this advice and you want encouragement, please check out my website, superiorselfwithkjlandis.com. And my new book is available for pre-order now. You can find the link in the show notes. It's called Happy Healthy You, your total wellness toolkit. Excuse me, your total wellness toolkit for renewing body, soul, and mind. Until next time, stay positive, stay blessed.